Hello, thank you for joining me today. We're reading through A Course in Miracles, the daily lessons, and today we're on, um, we're on a focus lesson today uh, in between these uh, 10 sets of lessons that we've been working our way through. So uh, getting ready to start lesson 271, and then this is the focus lesson introducing the week, or rather the 10 lessons that will follow. What is the Christ? Christ is God's son as he created him. He is the self we share, uniting us with one another and with God as well. He is the thought which still abides within the mind that is his source. He has not left his holy home, nor lost the innocence in which he was created. He abides unchanged forever in the mind of God. Christ is the link that keeps you one with God and guarantees that separation is no more than an illusion of despair, for hope forever will abide in him. Your mind is part of his and his of yours. He is the part in which God answers lies, where all decisions are already made and dreams are over. He remains untouched by anything the body's eyes perceive, for, through in, for though in him his father placed the means for your salvation, yet does he remain the self who, like his father, knows no sin. Home of the Holy Spirit, and at home in God alone, does Christ remain at peace within the heaven of your holy mind. This is the only part of you that has reality and truth. The rest is dreams. Yet will these dreams be given unto Christ to fade before his glory and reveal your holy self, the Christ, to you at last. The Holy Spirit reaches from the Christ in you to all your dreams and bids them come to him to be translated into truth. He will exchange them for the final dream which God appointed as the end of dreams. For when forgiveness rests upon the world and peace has come to every son of God, what could there be to keep things separate for what remains to see except Christ's face? And how long will this holy face be seen when it is but the symbol that the time for learning now is over and the goal of the atonement has been reached at last? So therefore, let us seek to find Christ's face and look upon nothing else. As we behold his glory, will we know we have no need of learning or perception or of time or anything except the Holy Self, the Christ whom God created as his son. And this is you. God created you as his child, as his son or daughter. And Christ is in you, whether you realize it or not. We are all aspects of divinity. Christ shows us the way, how to live and be human as a child of God. And so the lessons that are being given here are very important. And I hope that you're, you're enjoying them and learning from them. If you need additional support, you can reach out to me, 907-351-3003. You can text me. Uh, you can message me on Facebook, on SoundCloud, and on YouTube. I hope you have a great day with this. Stay tuned for the first lesson of this week that will accompany this focus lesson. And I'll see you here tomorrow as well, hopefully. Namaste and much love.